after I brought this shampoo and conditioner, like I'm not doing the hair culture, um, or like, you know, wash their hair culture. Um, but, I uh, left my little paper, but um, basically, we all are familiar with the company um, Dove, the soap company Dove. And so, um, you know, they're a worldwide known brand. And recently, they just launched this Love Your Curls campaign. And according to Dove, they say that only 10% of American women with wavy hair are proud of their curls. Um, and 40% of girls um, with curly hair um, think that they're beautiful. Um, so, you know, um, for my culture artifact, I wanted to um, introduce everybody to the curly hair culture because if you don't have curly hair, you never experience um, it's it's way different and you know um it, it does take it, it takes a lot of confidence to have curly hair um i feel like because um you it's not sleek it's not straight you won't necessarily blend in when you walk in a room because you're going to have this big wild hair and there's a lot of misconceptions about it that you know that it's you know oh, it's unkept it's nappy or tangly and it sometimes it's all of that and um you know, so um, um, I feel like um, after um, I give my speech, you guys will have a greater understanding of um, curls and um, just the whole curly uh, culture. Um, Dove, um, Dove vision is for, um, Dove's world vision is that they want, is they want to see a world where beauty is a source of confidence um, and not anxiety. Um, their mission is to help the next generation um, develop a positive relationship with the way that they look. Um, you know, Dove, like I said, Dove is a world-recognized brand, and um, in 2004, they launched the Dove Self-Esteem Project. Um, it was founded um, in 2004, and um, it, it wants to just help the next generation grow up feeling happy and confident. Um, Dove Global Research, they found that 72% 72, 72 of women feel pressured to um, be beautiful. So, um, I, you know, it was really amazing to see um, all that Dove does because, you know, we just think of it as like, you know, this little personal care line. But, um, you know, with this whole Love Your Growth campaign, um, it's really much more and they are trying to um, empower women and girls and make them, you know, feel beautiful in their skin and love their hair. Um, I feel, you know, I grew up, you know, I've had curly hair my whole life. Um, I never liked it as a kid. I I hated it. Um, I wore my hair, they go lighter in the winter, darker in the summer. So it came summertime, I went darker, and my curls didn't come back. <laughs> I freaked out. And I didn't understand why I was freaking out. I'm like, oh, I don't even like these curls. Like, but they're gone. And I just realized that, you know, you know, curly hair for me and just as for a culture, it it really is what defines us. Like it's our identity and once it it does or if it does get taken away, um you feel lost just like with anything that you love, whether it's skateboard, the painting, just anything that you love, if it gets taken away, you feel a little lost. And I realized that that's where I was. I was I was a little lost and I didn't um you know, I didn't know, so I've been in this um, re repair, and I try my hardest to um, repair my hair. Um, and so this is kind of the process that I am in now, um, trying to get my curls back, and um, you know, um, just that. Um, but um, and so Dove, they recently just, um, like I said, they recently just launched this Love Your um, Love Your Curls campaign. And they introduced their, it's called the Dove Advanced Hair Series, and it's the Quench Absolute Thirst for Curly Coarse Hair. And um, it's a really great product. It hydrates your curls, um, and it gives them four times more definition. And for curly hair girls, like, that's what we look for. We want something to tame our frizz, hydrate our hair, and also define our curls so that you can see the beauty in them, and everybody else can see what we see. <coughs> Um, and so it's a really it's a really good product. Um, I identify with the culture, like I said, because my whole life I've had curly hair, and I try to find myself with my curly hair and not try to manipulate it. Because curly hair girls, most of the time, we look for solutions for our curly hair rather than trying to enhance them and celebrate our curls.
So um, I just hope that um, now after my speech that you guys got a better um, insight into the curly hair world and thank you.